Hey guys, you know it's your boy Tevin from FUT Watch Club and you know it's a new year 2024 and I really appreciate you guys here. So for this year, what we have on the channel, just a quick rundown of what we're going to do on the channel. Um, what we have on the channel this year is we're going to do, or still going to do some watch reviews as usual. But this year I think that I'm going to add a few tips and tricks um, in the watch world as I know a lot of persons, um, we dabble in the watch industry so... A lot of tips and tricks went out there in the watch world and um, a little bit more info information right so i'm gonna do some info information videos and today this would be the first of many so today what we're gonna do is i'm gonna talk about how to properly authenticate a rolex right as i know that um, rolexes are the pinnacle of the watch world there is a lot of them here and a different lot of types i know most persons are interested in rolex and so when you guys are buying right i wouldn't want you guys to buy a fake watch so i'm just gonna give you a few signs to look out for when purchasing a rolex so that you guys get the real thing and the best value for money right so the first way out to authenticate a rolex here is look out for the laser edge crown at the six hour mark right so at the six hour mark here uh, you guys would have to focus to see this because the crown is minuscule and it is very hard to see right but once you focus or even use a magnifying glass here at the six hour mark you should see the laser x rolex crown here that's the first step to prove authenticity and then secondly you can look out for the markings inside the bezel right so at the in at the top inside the bezel the word rolex should be clearly written on both sides of the bezel and a quick tip about this as well is that this actually started in 2005 so the rolex models created after 2005 would have the markings inside the bezel that says the word rolex right and then thirdly if you remove the band from the watch you should see the serial number and the model number of the watch between the lugs on the right side of the case right so here at the right side of the case, once you remove the watch band, here you should clearly see the written serial number and the model number. This is one of the signs that the watch is actually a real Rolex, right? And then fourthly, once you open the watch up here, the, you will see the swift movement that lets the watch run perpetually while you wear it, right? So the swift movement here is the pinnacle of Rolex watches right so if you get a Rolex and you open it up and you do not see the Swiss, Swiss movement that is a telltale sign that the watch is not a real Rolex because all Rolex watches here you, once you open it up you will see the Swiss movement here that lets the watch run perpetually while you wear it and then lastly on both side of the movement and the case match and the case back i'm sorry you should see the word rolex etched here so you see you should see a few words here on the movement and case back you should see etch the word rolex geneva switzerland and also you will see a few quotes right so at the back you should see the words rolex geneva switzerland and some quotes etched here so if you see maybe rolex and you see geneva and you don't see switzerland it is not real it's not a real rolex or if you just see the word rolex but you don't see the location geneva switzerland this watch is not a real rolex guys so once you're out in the market and you're buying a rolex it doesn't hurt to take a few seconds to go ahead and look at these five details here and just to focus to ensure that you're getting a big bang for your money right so just a quick summary here of what i ran through here in this video is just look for the laser just look for the laser edge crown at the six hour mark firstly look for the word rolex markings inside the bezel remove the band you should see the serial number and the model number between the logs at the right side open the watch look for the swiss movement and then on both sides of the movement and the case at the back, you should see the words Rolex, Geneva, Switzerland, and some course here. Once you guys get this done, you can never be swindled by someone in buying a fake Rolex, guys. So that's just a quick little tip here 
to authenticate a Rolex. As I said, more information videos will be coming. So you guys stay tuned. Watch reviews will be coming as well. We have some bomb watch reviews that we are going to do here on the channel. And then as always, guys, just look out for more content as this year we'll be pushing out a lot of content. And then just look out for my Instagram that is tagged below here, guys. I just want you guys to press like on this video if you do and just keep following as this year we have a lot of big things coming. And again, it's your boy Tevin from Foot Wash Club. Hope you guys have a great one and all the best.